everybody so we have the campsite area tent area completed so let's take a look around and i'll show you what we did and remember it don't have to be beautiful this has to be functional ain't that right blake uh -huh. and there's my point so anyways we Took two 10 by 10 20s, making a 20 by 20 living space. They cannot touch both campers. Um, yeah, tensioning rod. They can't touch both campers because we found out that, well, a child moves in this camper and that one starts moving too. Like, holy cow. So we took some plastic over the top and leaned it onto there. I tied it up, came down with the screen. All the way around, we have a door that's in the back, and we have a wash station, some water, some trash that's over there, and a, that's a lovely wife. She loves being on camera. Um, <clears throat> that's a work area that we just got done messing around with in our stove. It's not complete yet, and our grill here. So the this for this to work i'll need to get a um <clears throat> fiber board and then we'll put that in place around this and then the chimney can go out and up and we can secure it and that will uh obviously not melt the screen but the screen is to help with the nighttime bugs you don't we don't get a ton um, but we do get enough to where if you've had so many days of rain you get a little bit more than you'd like and then you get these big horse flies. That's a little fly. And you get the, I don't know, they're like buffalo flies. The freaking thing. I don't know what to do with those. So anyways, we get the big old flies, black flies and stuff. Not killed with this other chemical that we've used. So they are just nasty and they bite and welts. But this is our main uh, hangout area. Keep dry area. Nice and cozy area. And our cook area. Um, so that's what we have this is what our setup is for now we'll do a little bit of cleanup I'll put up a little charge station for some batteries for the kids to be able to plug their, their stuff in I have a look right here oh found this guy in the back 40 yeah anybody know what that skull is because I don't there was a jawbone, and like the rest of the skeleton, we left them there. We just wanted a skull because we thought it was cool. So, kind of nifty. Um, I'm going to say carnivore. Carnivore. But, if you know what it is, leave a comment. Let me know. So, um... That's what we have. This is what we worked on. Keep us dry. Keep us bug free and enjoyable relaxation at nighttime. Oh, and I used this gate. See this panel here? So it does have a latch. We're not really needing the latch necessarily. So it's just screen all the way around it. And that will allow us to walk in and out with ease and not having issues um, doing a zipper door that's annoying so looks like dinner is done we got some spaghetti we got to mix up our famous cook Alexandria so all right that's uh that's what we did for the day got that done and now it's the next stuff so, want to see what that is well you're gonna need to like subscribe and follow us to see what we'll keep coming up with. Alright, remember, healthy, happy animals lead to healthy, happy people. Be blessed, have fun, and we'll see you on the next one.